Hi folks, Captain Mike Hogan here from Hoagie Lure Company. I'm here today with Captain Nat Chalkley from Get The Net Charters. We're fishing a spot called The Claw, which is about 15 miles south of Martha's Vineyard. Uh, the fish today, uh, we think, are keyed in on sand eels, so we're gonna stay with smaller baits. We're fishing a seven rod spread, classic spring bluefin spread. We have four 40 inch, six inch bulb squid spreader bars on the inside and outside riggers. And then on our flat lines, we're gonna fish um, larger soft baits, the hoagie harness jigs in sand eel colors. We're gonna fish the flat lines a little further back than we normally do, so they flank the inside outrigger spreader bars. We're gonna be trolling seven knots. It's a very calm day today, we find. Um, on greasy calm days, uh, we tend to speed the boat up and fish lures a little further back than we normally do. Um, you know, it's textbook conditions today. Uh, great spring tuna fishing day. Nice fish on here. Took about 300 yards of line. Just stop the boat, clear the lines, start working on them. Try and get them in here, see what he is. So I'm just positioning this boat while Nat's on this fish. I like to keep the fish off the corner of the boat. And so I'm just in and out of gear. This is very ergonomic to have the fish at a, at a, at a 45 degree angle off the corner here. And uh, you know, I have the controls on the starboard side, so I always keep everything on the starboard side here. I'm just gonna put the, star, the port engine in gear. That'll swing the bow to starboard. All right, we got color, Mike. All right, so this fish came in on the shrimp colored spreader bar. This is a very natural color. Um, you know, again, these fish are keyed in on sand eels. Uh, we're gonna get this fish Looks super sharp, BMC 7.0, floral leader, and the, uh, we have a nine inch finger behind the six inch bird. So what I like to do when I'm handling a fish, but I know I'm gonna release a stick of salt water hose in this one. And then I uh, wanna get the boat in here now. So I'm gonna carefully release this fish. Now you see this bar? A little discombobulated after that fish. Uh, that is pretty much by design. These bars are made with such light wire frames that when they're trolling, the bar just pulses. And for some reason, I always find the more dinged up these bars get, the fishier they get. And uh, you know, they, we use the lightest steel. Uh, we, rec we like the spring steel over titanium because it's so soft, so fluid. With these little baits, these little small six-inch squids. They just pulse and dance and dart. And um, they have very light resistance. You can fish them on very light tackle. I have Talica 25s here, certainly not big heavy outfits. And uh, they just do the trick. So we're putting out the uh, four, our 40 inch squid bar in the shrimp color. The, uh, the bar we just caught the last fish on. On the inside rigger, we need to be careful to stay inside. The other line, I'm gonna put it back out. Oh, we're on. So this sweet outfit is from Shimano. Now this reel may not look very big, but it's got plenty of uh, say boots to it. It's the Talica 25, and it's paired on a on a Therese rod. Really? No drag. These fish have all been about 50 pounds. Really putting it to it. The like just been fantastic. Easily a 50 pound tuna. This rod just whooped it. And again, they're keyed in on these Big spreader bars with small squids. The claw south of Martha's Vineyard, greasy calm conditions, fish are cooperating, plenty of life. Uh, couldn't ask for a better June day to kick off the tuna season.